Alright, so, welcome back to Let's Play Crusader Kings 2. Didn't get a whole lot of comments about what people wanted me to do. I got some, but uh, not as many as I thought would be definitive. Uh, so, I'm just gonna go, f you know, status quo. I'm recording the whole thing for now. I've got kind of a short day today, so I'll probably just put out one episode and then do more tomorrow. Uh, so... Again, I will pose the question, should I be cutting stuff out? And if you've replied in the other comments, I saw it, so don't worry about that. Um, if I'm not responding to the comments, it's because, well, the Google Plus thing does not allow me to do that right now. So, yeah. Um, anyway, nothing much is going to be going on, so I'm going to be running at a pretty fast speed. And basically, uh, when I do cut, I want to give you a little bit more specific about what I want to do then. I'm basically just going to be showing when important things happen to the current character that I am. Whether he dies, whether there's a big war. I probably won't show the minor rebellions if I choose to do that. Because, I mean, they're largely unconsequential. Whoa. Hey. I don't have a chance of dying. <laughs> um. Well, I didn't. <laughs> okay. Um. But we're basically gonna keep an eye on the Empire, make sure everything's running okay. One of the things I want to do is because we're old. Um. I want to take the province, take this title from him. Because, uh, well, it's being a pain in my neck. There. Now Egypt has it, and I don't have to worry about it anymore. Now everybody hates me more, but I don't really care. I'll probably die of... Oh, looks like Perm's doing well. I'll probably die of concubines sooner or later. Nah, whatever. We'll do that, too. It probably won't even go through. Let's check our vassal's opinions of us. Ooh, that one's... Ah, oh, that one's always like that. Never mind. <laughs> Setrip of Hormuz. Where's that? Here. What's your deal? Lots of stuff. The Arg of Kish. The Arg of Kish. Do I own it? Uh, is this my direct vassal? It is. Okay. Okay. Always good to look for things like that. Looking for Kish here. There. And you can have a cup. And money. There. Um, Mesopotamia, I would actually like if they revolted. Ambitious. I'm not going to do anything about that. Basically, anything below a duke is not really of any consequence. Yeah, so I don't care. I have counts. Where is this? Oh, it's because of a war. Yeah. What's going on here? Hmm. Tyranny. War. Alright, whatever. She probably doesn't even help. Nope. She's already won. And George is helping. What's Perm doing? Pretty good. How are the Muslims doing? Hmm. Not very well. I'm confident they will survive until the end of the game. 
scholarly theologian. Okay. Hmm. Okay, uh, sure. Don't care. Oops. That was a fast war. Whatever. I might also show interesting events or things related to assassinations or things like that. Ooh, Shabazz. This guy is presumably our heir. So that's really good. Our heir after our brother, that is. Although I might make him my heir now. That's weird. <laughs> um... Who was that guy? He had a weird name. This guy. Well, he's almost the same age, so never mind. I was thinking maybe if he was younger, that would be an advantage, but... Uh, what? He's trying to kill somebody. Oh, nope. It already did that. It already took care of it. Okay. Alright. So what do I need to pass that? Oh, my spy master died. Uh, that could have been bad. Had so many guys leading troops and dying in battle that I didn't have some of my stuff doing things. Who's this? She is Von Dodd's... Yeah, be humble. It's a good idea. I'd like to think of myself as a magnanimous person, but I've started to feel uneasy while talking to the servants. The courtiers clearly do not find it fitting for a shot and shot to consort with the servants. You say to hell with them and get a minus ten with everybody. Fine. I'll stop talking to the servants. I, I guess I lose Gregarious. Um, and everybody likes me better. Fuck them. <laughs> Talk to the servants all I want. Oh, that guy didn't have a foot. Sorry, Cyrus. I guess you need a new... Husband. Whoa. Okay. Go to perm. Did I get stressed? Nope. What do you want now? Ingemar's conquest of Azov. Who's Ingemar? I do have those, um, what are they called, uh, baronies to do stuff with, but, eh, whatever, I don't really care. Let's see if he's got more than 11,000 dudes, or 14, 15,000. Nope. Oh, well... At least one of his appendages worked, if not his leg. It's not always the leg. You can get maimed for something else. It's just that's the picture. So I always go by what the picture says because that's easier. It's like Perm's not doing super great in the war. I think that's pretty. 
status quo for Europe. Let's fight in Sweden. Oh, okay, maybe Perma's doing okay. <laughs> Is that all of their wars? Yep, yeah, looks like it. Hey. You've broken them up even more. Somebody killed him. Well, I guess that's over. <laughs> Peasant revolt. Oh, no. Peasants. Stuff like this, I won't show. You never know how bad a a war for a uh, an ally could be, but just like 6,000 guys. This is Golnaz. One more. Yeah. Just. Just is a good trait. Kind. Kind's good too. Oh, somebody was asking me to make a group a holy order called the Immortals. They're going to do that in the, in the expansion. The one that uh, Sons of Abraham. So. Or whatever it's called. I'm not going to do that, and it's not going to really come into play in this anyway. It's not like I need a holy order. Plus, I don't really want to do the work um, proting probably, probably an inferior uh, concept in place. Oh, apparently I had Serbia's wife or something. Get out of here. Ooh, some money. Hey, the humorous rot in my living body. Really, it's not, uh, it's not a priority at the moment. So, sorry to disappoint, uh, whoever that was. I can never remember names. Get a spread of tech or something because I couldn't build some of the stuff before. Stables. Training grounds. I got enough money. Stables. And Kirkuk. Training grounds. Alright. I mean, eventually, I, to do some major reorganization, uh, I could basically just tank my influence with all of my vassals and see how will things play out. That might be how I end up breaking up the Empire. Uh, hmm. The clergy is not satisfied with collecting a tithe from all free peasants. They demand to collect an extra tithe. Tithe is a tenth of the peasant's harvest, or a tenth of the craftsman's production. If the priests are allowed to collect another tithe, that would double the taxes and thus make the peasants protest wildly. Oh man, don't do that. I already have enough problems with the peasants. I really hope this goes through, and the Ethiopians start using the African skins again. Oh, looks like the Warkids are back in business. And Vandad, blah blah, charitable. Alright. Yeah, whatever. And it can't protect you from yourself, at self Abyssinia. Uh oh. Oh, this is only a 20%, uh. <laughs> 20% chance we die, and a 40% chance of lustful. Let's see. Hey, we didn't die. Such as that would never kill a descendant of Von Dodd. It's 
Speaking of which, oh <laughs> yeah, we need another concubine. Okay. Uh, no. Oh, okay. She was trying to kill me or something? Goals in. Is that one of my... No, but I do need another concubine. It's just for prestige, anyway. That would be weird. Um, looks like the crop of concubines is aged <laughs> to the point that it's no longer concubiney. Must be why I'm not inundated with kids. Whatever. It doesn't really matter. Now, another thing we want to do is we want these guys here. Not these guys, these guys. Out of the hands of the Shah of Armenia. However, it doesn't seem like a good idea to do that at the moment. This is Satrapy of Tripoli. That's what this is. Because I've already taken two things away. <laughs> what? Oh, there's an actual, like, uh, Pope. Monophysite Pope. Hey, Monophysite Pope. Patriarch. Whatever. Monopope. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Wait. You again? Oh, this is an actual war. Okay. Ooh, with Byzantium involved. Hmm. We can nip this one in the bud. That's an auspicious number of votes. I like it. Ooh. This guy wants... What? Thrace? I don't think so. Sometimes you have baronies that people want, and that's that's reasonable. What are you doing, man? Alright, yeah, we'll just siege this. Go below a uh, certain value. Mm -hmm. Figures. You know what? Borrow some guys. Ah! You are stupid. Mmm, that would be stupid. Oh. Apparently we are stupid. Time to stupid them in back! In the face. Time to save that. Bonk. Whatever. I believe we still have the thing that wants us to improve our intrigue. That seems like a thing that we have. Okay. Oh, 
Akuma. Oh, okay. Whatever. Fine. I don't care. I don't care about your ships. F your ships. Uh oh. Looks like Perm. Looks like they're greedy sights on, uh. Except down here, that guy doesn't have any eyes. What happened to your eyes? You need those. It's probably one of the wars with uh, the Byzantines. What is this? What's the deal with this? Um, they're helping. Yeah, they're helping. Good job, Perm. Well, looks like they're not having any problems up here. Hmm. They still need an awful lot for Russia. I don't think they're going to get to it. That's fine. I actually don't expect them to... These guys change color. I don't expect them to survive overly well into the end. If people wanted me to <laughs> let them get killed by the Mongols, I wasn't going to do that. Stupid Mongols would just ruin everything. Yes, they're likely to convert to Zoroastrianism, but they would culturally destroy everything in the area. They are huge jerks like that. Ooh. Skilled tactician, hmm? See if we have a use for you. The Duke of Rostov, huh? It looks like that's really the only high ranking dude up here except the Shah of Syria, but you know, whatever. Yeah. Go marry that guy. Egypt? Wait, where was I raising Egypt's troops? There? Oh, it's not de though, so I don't really care. Let's get on here. You want to marry my daughter? Right, okay. That was the plan. I remember that. That was, in fact, the plan. Wait, what the heck? Mesopotamia. Naive appeaser. Was that Bondod? That would be disappointing. Yeah, it was. Hmm. I guess he's not gonna be the king. So you, eh. rather not provoke something else with them right now. Hey, charity. Sixty-five. Wonder what the longest of our. Kings turned out to be 58, 69, 57, 52. That guy died young. Oh, Past the emperors. Sayo Shunt. He likes the desert. Has no foot. Honestly, I would kind of like to see our our reign of our chain of um, dudes to end Venetians. Mm. You know what? Let it go. It'll be more interesting that way. Somebody will probably destroy it. Come on. You know what? Meh.
Yeah, I think the first thing to go is... Oh. Well, you guys are awful. Have fun together, being awful. I'm surprised we're not on, like, Vondod the 16th. I suppose it's largely due to, uh... The fact that the AI has controlled a couple of my heirs with their names. Okay. Did you just imprison your heir? No. I like seeing the AI get- ooh! It's like, Britannia is having some problems. Silesian League of Independence War. That might be a bit more interesting. Um. Okay. Apparently, I had planned that. That's fine. Perm's doing some reorganization. Come on, guys. Go kill Novgorod. Do it. There's so little they need to. Well, they've been so unstable. It's it's kind of hard for them to do stuff. I want votes. Where are my votes? Nobody wants to vote for me. Okay. That's fine. Uh, no. Sorry. No land for anyone. Okay. Let's see. What's going on here? Oh, okay. Well, okay, that was fine. Count Sabas. Damon had a problem with that, too. Did it spread? It doesn't look like it. Oh, somebody was wanting to look at the um, diplomatic relations map. This is it. This is our neck of the woods. Um, why do I have, this is what I wanted to see. Why did they, oh, cause, okay, I see. What do they have a claim on? Hmm. I want to look at the king. Okay, so I like them. They hold this, this. That's annoying as shit. Okay. And we are... Potential target. Why can I attack these guys? I have no idea. This is my direct holdings, so... He's a Rastrian. Why can I attack him? I do not. Wait, I do. Except for valid causes villi. What is my causes villi on this? Oh, it's probably one of my courtiers causes villi's. Yeah, it's junk like that. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> Well, I suppose it's because it's owned by Burgundy, and Burgundy is close enough. Uh, Zoroastrianism is pretty dominant, as usual. 
It's even spreading up into Finland. Back to let's go the cultures. Depressingly Persian over here. Still Persian over here. <laughs> uh, even the Bedouins and Levantines are being driven out. Two Bedouin provinces here, two here. Two Levantine provinces. Quite a bit of Greek provinces, like six or seven. Or more than that. No Turkish provinces, no Kurdish provinces. Whatever. Um, hmm. I suppose I could take a look at... Ooh. I look very small on this screen. But that's because I own small, rich provinces. Looks like uh, Britannia is winning this rather handily. No, no, they're not. Oh, it must be because of this junk here. Okay. The Abbasids are back in charge over here. Hmm. Might call a crusade eventually. Saeed. Let's look at the trade zone, since people keep asking for that. An evento. Is that actually a separate thing? Ooh, Ascalon got all the way over to here. Genoa, Amalfi, Genoa. It's pretty much Ascalon over here in the Zoroastrian parts of the ocean. With a mix of Amalfi and Genoa on Greece and over here. Benevento, that's interesting. That's this guy, right? Hmm. This, uh, Malfi is pretty much Sicily at this point. Uh, they could even have the Sicily title, but they don't. 